Well, hi, Michael here, and today we're looking again at the book Meditations on Manhood, 100 Devotions from Charles Spurgeon, and we're looking at a section titled Stand Out and Stand Up. And the verse used is from 1 Corinthians 1, verse 31. That according as it is written, he that glorieth, let him glory in the Lord. Reading that again. That according as it is written, he that glorieth, let him glory in the Lord. 1 Corinthians 1, 31. And he pens. Glory in the Lord by standing up for him when he is opposed. If you hear the proud one ridicule his gospel and despise his people, put in a word for Jesus. Stand out and say, I am one of his disciples. Despise me. I hold those opinions. Ridicule me. After the way which ye call heresies, so worship I the Lord God of my fathers. This is a practical way of glorifying him. But many who have grown rich and respectable are much too mean-spirited to practice it. I am ashamed of the cowardly spirit of many in these days who give up their nonconformity because they cannot otherwise get into what they call good society. The Lord have mercy on them. Glorify him again by being calm under your troubles. When others are fretting and worrying, possesses your soul in patience, and say, No, I do not serve a fear with a God, and I am not to be cowed and put down, for the eternal God is my refuge, and underneath me are the everlasting arms. It does not become a man to tremble who has the God of Jacob for his help. I will bear trouble joyfully, if he wills to send it. Glory in the Lord, brethren, practically by having a contempt for those things which others value so much. Do not be greedy after the world. Love God too much to care for earthly treasures. If God gives you wealth, thank Him for it and use it. If He does not, do not worry about it. Feel that you are rich enough without the help of yellow metal. You have your God, and that is the best wealth. You have a heaven to go to, and a little heaven below. Rejoice in that which you find in your God. Live above the world. May God's Spirit help you. Yes, another pearl of great price. A fortitude, a stance. Stand out and stand up. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom.